అమృత్ మహోత్సవ్ ద గ్రోత్ అండ్ డెవలప్మెంట్ ఆఫ్ ఐఎండి ఇండియా మెట్రాలజికల్ డిపార్ట్మెంట్ థర్డ్ వీడియో ఐఎమ్ రిలీజింగ్ దిస్ ఇన్ మై యూట్యూబ్ ఛానల్ ఆల్ ఆవ్ ఇన్ కురల్ ఐ రిక్వెస్ట్ ఆల్ ఆఫ్ యూ టు కైండ్లీ సబ్స్క్రైబ్ ద ఛానల్ బై ప్రెసింగ్ ద సబ్స్క్రైబ్ యాజ్ వెల్ యాజ్ ది బెల్ ఐకాన్ today we are going to see about the great trigonometrical survey so in the last video that is the second video of the series i was telling about the first observatory of uh, imd that is madras observatory if you search in uh, internet by typing the world madras observatory you will get a lot of information about it my videos i do not want to Uh, have bigger large videos means uh, lengthy videos beyond 10 10 minutes i don't want to have my video so i have given whatever possible information during that time okay today when we talk about uh, uh, the madras observatory you cannot uh, miss talking about the great trigonometrical survey so in india in uh, imd the daily weather briefing is done by showing several maps now this is digital uh, world uh, computerized uh, uh, computer generated weather maps are uh, uh, being shown in the uh, website of india meteorological department so prior to that uh, we were manually drawing these uh, observations on a chart and uh, Uh, these uh, uh, charts are analyzed by our experts and uh, the forecasts were given so maps they are all very important uh, part of imd so how these maps came that we also should know we all should know this uh, uh, let us let us uh, see a small presentation of this the great trigonometrical survey so in this uh, azadi gamar mahotsav video series 26th january to 15th august 2022 topic is growth and development of india meteorological department imd i am dr k v balas brahmanian retired meteorologist from chennai so when you come to the rmc chennai the rmc chennai campus is the uh, site where the first observatory was opened in india which we have seen in the last video so there are several monuments there is a very big granite pillar and uh, there is a board describing what is uh, what are all these uh, monuments in that uh, rmc chennai so this is that uh, pillar and you have got a very nice uh, uh, english inscription uh, on this pillar and uh, just by the side of the pillar there is another inscription this is the inscription but uh, because of light uh, you are not uh, you will not be able to see what is written here there so i have put another picture here this is written in latin so here also they have given some uh, this is ad md cc xc this is uh, the year there is another uh, uh, in the same pillar uh, this is the english inscription and this is the tamil inscription so if you are able to read kaliyaptam uh, some year they have put okay in tamil they have written varshathil uh, இங்கிலீஷு கும்பனியார் ஆகாசத்தில் இருக்கின்ற லைக் தட் இட் கோஸ் ஆன் ஓகே அண்ட் தெர் இஸ் தெலுங்கு இன்ஸ்கிரிப்ஷன் ஆல்சோ அண்ட் ஸ்லைட்லி இன் தி அப்பர் ஒன் தெர் இஸ் அ 
Urdu inscription also. So this uh, uh, William Lambton, about uh, whom we have we have seen uh, in the last video also. This is the man who started this trigonometrical survey because the uh, longitude of uh, Chennai was available at the time. He started it from Nungabakam Observatory, measured the distance between Nungabakam Observatory to uh, St. Thomas Mount and from St. Thomas Mount to the uh, Perumbakam. So in both these places, there are uh, some uh, monuments available. I am unable to get that uh, a monument which is there in Perumbakam. However, in uh, St. Thomas Mount, we have got one statue. This statue was put in the year 2002 by Geological Survey of India because uh, uh, now uh, this uh, survey department has gone from IMD to Geological Survey. So uh, the uh, because of this man's, uh, William Lambton's uh, trigonometrical survey, only maps are there. So in 2002, bicentennial uh, celebration, this uh, great trigonometrical survey started from Nungambakam uh, in the year 1802, April 10, 1802. This is, uh, which is written here in this uh, English uh, version of the uh, inscription. So uh, from here, this, uh, 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 survey started and went up to uh, Nagpur in uh, in a place called Hingan Ghat near Nagpur. This man, uh, Lambton, got fever and died there and he was buried here. This is his uh, memorial uh, because this is made of black stone. They have, uh, they are telling it as Kalagatta. So after him, George Everest took over. So after that, many people were in charge of this uh, survey and uh, they found out the height of the uh, tallest peak in the world and named it on behalf of their officer, George Everest. That is why this uh, Mount Everest got its name. So the maps, what we are seeing, the maps, what we are studying in our schools, geography books, atlas, all these things are because of the uh, trick, uh, great trigonometrical survey or the great geodetic survey, which started from Chennai at the College Road, Bungabakam Regional Meteorological Office, uh, where it is functioning now. From that site, it started. In memory of that, we have got uh, several monuments and one benchmark also is there. <clears throat> so this uh, uh, students can come and uh, uh, visit many students from uh, uh, nearby uh, colleges where they are studying geography. Uh, they used to come and see this benchmark and monuments and all in our office. Now we have traveled uh, uh, a lot in the scientific side from maps to GPS. Now. Our mobile phones show maps, uh, where to go, how to go and all. But all these things, the beginning was from Nungambakam Observatory, College Road, Chennai, where Regional Meteorological Center is functioning. Okay, my dear friends, kindly subscribe to my channel by pressing subscribe and bell icon. We will meet in the next video. Thank you.